You are listening to Results Over BS. You're about to find out the secrets to building a wildly profitable online business without the confusion or overwhelm so you can finally have the lifestyle of freedom you've always wanted. Markwell Russell is internationally known for helping his clients turn their passions, knowledge, and expertise into premium price programs that bring in tens of thousands of dollars each month. Here's Markwell. Hey, what's up, my friend? Markwell Russell here, and welcome to another brand new episode of The Results Over BS. And today we're going to talk about how to avoid the dreaded entrepreneurial burnout. Now, before I get into that, I want to let you know, because it's going to be really juicy. Um, it's probably going to step on some toes as well, as usual, a lot of times when I do these episodes, right? But before y'all get into that, I want to let you know that to get access to our Rapid Business Growth Bundle, a lot of people have been sending amazing reviews from the Rapid Business Growth Bundle, and they're wondering why we're giving away for free. Ultimately, it's just our way of saying thank you for checking out the show. Okay, so all you got to do to get access to it, if you first, if you want to get more clients, if you want to grow your business with more leverage, have more free time, and of course, avoid this entrepreneurial burnout, either go to yourpodgift.com, that's Y O U R P O D G I F T.com, or take out your phone and just text the words results over BS, that's R E S U L T S over BS to 33444. So the words results over BS to 3344. Four. All right, so let's talk about how to avoid entrepreneurial burnout. Because of course, we live in a society right now where everybody tells you that you should hustle, hustle, hustle. You got to be on, you know, Facebook posting and all this different type of stuff. Two, three, four, five, six a.m. in the morning, and just work twenty four hours, seven days a week, and just work your face off, as some people would tell you, right? And it's merit to that. If that's your thing and that's what you want to do, it's your life, it's your business, right? I'm just doing this particular episode for individuals who may feel burnt out or, or or who may be going down that path and want to make sure they avoid. This entrepreneurial burnout. And I'm going to share with you how I did it because me, I used to work like crazy. I always felt like I had to be working. I felt guilty about unplugging sometimes. And I'll be honest, I love what I do. So sometimes it's still hard to unplug, but I'm able to work because I want to because I love what I do, not because I just feel obligated to actually be hands-on because I'm, I feel like I'm missing money. And there's a few ways to go about doing this. Number one, you have to put an automated system in place where your business still runs regardless if you're hands-on or not. So if you still want to be getting leads and clients coming in every single day, you have to be doing that because if not, your business will go through this feast and famine mode where you always feel like you got to be hands-on. And again, in a rapid business growth um, bundle, I help you put a system in place so you can attract these ideal clients. So I'll give you some free training on how to do that. Number two, I would put a reward system in place. This is something I did for myself. So this past year, I set a goal that every quarter I was going to take my family on some kind of getaway, some kind of trip. It doesn't have to be anything exotic or anything like that, but we was going to go somewhere, right? And when we go, we was going to go somewhere. And also I, what I was going to do is do a recap. So I was going to recap of what happened over the past quarter and then my plans for the next quarter coming ahead. So every quarter was going to go somewhere. We're going to go on some kind of trip. And of course, even between that time, we'll do so. We can still, I set some kind of thing in place that I'm looking forward to. Right. So that could be the trip every quarter. That could be something we're doing on the weekend or that's we could be going out to eat, whatever the case may be. You know, and that's how you put these reward systems in place. It's the same thing if you're on a fit, if you're on your fitness journey, you want to lose weight all through the week. You want to eat clean. But let's just say Saturday, you want to have a quick treat. Right. Now, nothing crazy, but just some kind of treat that you're going to you know, reward yourself for sticking it out. And when you do this, not only do you reward yourself from a business standpoint, you give yourself something to look forward to at the end of the quarter or something to work towards to at the end of the week or whatever. And also you reward your family because your family obviously sacrifices as well because, you know, you work in the, you know, the late hours or traveling or whatever the case may be. And you want to just reward them for just being a part of the journey with you because just hustle, hustle, grind, 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 grind without reward leads to burnout, my friend. Grind, 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 hustle, hustle without reward leads to burnout because here's the news. That income goal or that goal or whatever that you're looking to accomplish that you're going after is always on the horizon, meaning you never get there because once you, let's say your goal is 20000 a month. Once you get to 20000 a month, you're not going to just sit back with your feet up. You're going to say, all right, let me get to 30000 Let me get to 40, 50, 60. Because you're an entrepreneur, you're driven by the goal, right? So you don't want to, you want to set yourself up while you're always chasing after this thing. And once you accomplish this thing, then you're going to do this. You want to start doing it now at some level, Okay. So you may not better go rent the island right now, but you can just take your family on a two-day getaway or something, get a nice hotel or whatever. Or maybe it's just a hotel downtown just for a couple of days. 
you know, in your city, a nice hotel or something. Just some kind of reward. I highly recommend you do that. And if you've been already doing this, leave it in a comment below. Let me know your thoughts. And of course, let me know your thoughts on this. Or are you going to go ahead and put this in your books and how you're going to start approaching your business so you can avoid this entrepreneurial burnout, okay? So with that being said, my friend, leave us a comment. Let me know if you got some value. I want to hear from you. Reach out and let me know. I appreciate everybody who's reaching out. And I want to hear from more people. Leave us a comment. Let me know. Message on Facebook. I'm here for you. Um, if you're on iTunes, leave us a five-star rating and review so we can get this in front of more people. And if you're on YouTube, Facebook, or whatever, leave us a comment. Let me know if you're getting value. Let me know if there's some other topics you want me to hit on, and I'd be more than happy to do that. All right. So be sure to go get your rapid business growth bundle at yourpodgift.com or texting results over BS to 33. 33- Four, four, four. And until the next episode, my friend, have a phenomenal day because you absolutely deserve it. Talk to you soon.